Make sure you stay until the end, we will explain about common mistake people make when replacing fuses and that can cost you quite a bit of money. Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Live. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be a super helpful video to any of you having a BMW 4 Series generation F32, F33, F36. <coughs> this guy is specifically the 4 Series BMW from year 2013 to year 2020. If you guys have one of those, you need to find where the engine computer relay is located. Which relay you need to check, where you can buy cheap fuses, relays, parts, tools at a good price, quick shipping, that way you do not waste your money. And why it's important to test fuses and relays, all that guys will be covered absolutely free for your convenience make sure you stay until the end now even though we have bmw 3 series here at the garage 3 and 4 series are built on the same platform many of the things will be really close or about the same but specifically we will explain about bmw 4 series engine computer relay in this video today before we start guys let me tell you a little bit about us if you guys need to find fuses relays for that bmw 4 series generation from 2013 to 2019 we'll make video for every single fuse relay why because let's say you're in the middle of nowhere you need to find where the fuel injector or fuel pump fuse is located you have multiple hidden fuses you can find and replace it get back on the road guys fix that problem because otherwise okay you'll be stuck in the middle of nowhere every single car we get here at the garage guys we take them completely apart we show you how to fix pretty much anything from transmissions engines bodywork guys all that will be on our channels check it out let me show you where you can find more about it right here we have more than 10,000 free repair videos that can save you thousands of dollars in future repairs and if you need to buy parts tools fuses for your bmw or any car at a really good price quick shipping that way you do not waste your money we'll share the link in the description of the video below where you can get it from so let's start on it now so guys, what we have here, 2015 BMW 4 Series that we'll be working on, okay, right here. Now, fun fact about that car, you have up to six different fuse boxes. Most people know about two or three, but you have six and only one or two relays at the most. Most of the, most of the times you have only one relay for the radiator fan. But where are the other relays, guys? Okay, now you have one module, okay, in the trunk on the right side. Uh, when you remove that cover here if you uh, look through the hole there you see that fuse box with five fuses and that's known as a relay module okay uh, that's one of the functions there but for the engine computer you have guys fuses that are known as relay fuses up to 10 fuses that you need to check where they are located under the hood open the hood in front of the windshield on the passenger side and behind the shock tower you have one trim cover remove it you get to a fuse box open the cover and you see that fuse box layout before we continue let's explain why it's important to test fuses and relays it is guys very important to test fuses and relays on those fuses you cannot clearly see if they're burnt or not especially you can see in the jk's fuses as well and if you guys assume okay you, let's say you remove a fuse you look at it and you assume guys that it's a, actually a, a good fuse but it's actually a bad fuse sometimes you cannot clearly see that what can easily happen guys at that point uh, you can uh, uh, put the bad fuse in and you start replacing parts and tools that you don't need to so you lose your time you lose your money to fix a problem that doesn't exist when all we had to do is test the fuse and replace it we'll put a link to a special video that will teach you how to test fuses how to check relays very easily as well guys so uh, check it out it will be in the description of the video below here we'll need to check multiple fuses that's the road towards the windshield side the bottom is the front of the bmw passenger side driver side coming on this side you start with fuse number 18 19 so fuse number 19 needs to be checked 21 23 19 21 23 here 36 37 will need to be checked 43 and you go to 44 45 46 47 as well after that guys we're going to go okay actually uh, to a different fuse box that's in the trunk the main trunk fuse box under the cargo liner where that arrow is just pull that cargo liner out you see a main trunk fuse box that looks like this one here we will need to check now uh, specifically fuse number 137 right here 137 then you need to check 144 145 146 Hopefully guys the video will be helpful. If you have any questions let us know. Thank you for watching and see you next time.